brother was the one who really pushed to go, let's go into the fish business. When we were putting the store together, people would come by and look in and say, what's going in here? We'd say fish, fish market. And they would say, wrong place, Midland Park, never gonna work. And we both ran the business together many years and uh, we worked hard at it. So that's why we're still here. <laughs> Steve Sclafani, Peter's Fish Market, 86 Fulton Dock. Steve Sclafani, senior. I've been in the business for pretty much 50 years, and I love what I do. It's 12.30 a.m. Get up, uh, take a shower, head to the store. There could be anywhere from 50 to 75 voicemails on the on the tape, 30 to 40 text messages. I'll make my list, I'll know what we need to buy. I'll tell the guy who goes right to the market right away over the GW Bridge by like two and change uh, at the market and, and at a transfer station. You have to be a little bit off to be doing this because you're working in the middle of night, you're working in the middle of rain, you're working in the middle of snow, you're working in uh, all the elements. There's no break in our life. We still have our foot on the gas. When I was going to the market with my father or my grandfather, it was all outdoors. So if the temperature was two degrees, you were putting your hands into those boxes of ice to, you know, to, to see what kind of fish were in those boxes. It had uh, a life of its own. People are calling us now, like shippers. They've seen that we're a worthy customer. This phone right here is a blessing and a curse. Steve, do you need this? Steve, do you want that? Steve, I have a squid boat. I, you know, uh, okay, scallops are coming in. The Swaggy B is landing in Point Pleasant. Uh, the Michaela is, is landing with tile fish down in Viking Village. You know, it has allowed us access to more product than ever. It has allowed us access to customers at the drop of a hat but it also makes it a 24-7 business more than ever. It's the just, list just never it, ends. It, the list just keeps getting longer and longer. Every year I'm like, wow, look, look at the year we have. We just hired another fella. He can clean fish, he can cut fish, but he was amazed that we have four other fellas that cut all day for us. And he said, they're really professionals. They, they are extremely talented and they are extremely uh, knowledgeable at their craft. They are really, really special at what they do. We moved to 190 Godwin Ave almost five years ago. We had 3,800 square feet. We thought we were moving into the Taj Mahal. <laughs> and now we're taking over the other side of our building so I thought I was retiring. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, one of the fellas said to me that, I think we're gonna drag you out of here. If that's, that's what it is. But also, is. I think that's what keeps him sharp, that's what keeps him going, that's what, he's also young at mine. See, yeah. that's, that's why we can work together. <laughs> why? Because I love it and I'm working with my son. Doesn't get better than that. <laughs> <laughs>